Is he gonna pod me now? Dude, he's gonna pod me. Uh, well. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Sir Click, and we are in New Eden with another episode from our EVE Online Let's Play series. Meet our first MR cruiser, the awesome Amon. I'm using this dude here just for the introduction. It's not yet ready for battle. I do have two, um, what is it, 1600 millimeter plates fit on it and a lot of resists just in case if somebody decides to gank me I will have just enough buffer to dock into the station. This is the Doe Dixie station I'm using for this introduction actually for a reason because our um, duels remember we decided to have 1v1 for every episode so this episode's 1v1 happened in Doe Dixie that's why I'm still here. I'm gonna be doing the intro and the outro of this episode right in front of this station. Let me just get first to the updates before I tell you what's gonna happen this episode and actually leave you with the action. Well, <clears throat> the update is uh, that actually we haven't really uh, led a fleet yet. Remember we were trying to be a fleet commander. But I participated in several um, RVB fleets and every time I participate I learn a lot. I, I mean, let's face it, I have never been to a fleet before I joined RVB, before I started this Let's Play series. So there's a lot to learn just by being in the fleet. And I know the um, general advice of the veterans is that you just go in and like you learn by mistake. Uh, but um, right now I just don't feel ready to do that because there's a lot of stuff I don't understand at all in terms of what's going on around me. It's going to be a little bit difficult for me to make leadership decisions when I don't understand what's going on around me. So. I will have to wait another probably episode or two before I take out my very first fleet. Let's see how this goes. I know I shouldn't chicken out, I shouldn't let the fear uh, pos let me postpone or make me postpone for way too long because then it becomes a little difficult to jump into the action. I know that. I've heard that advice many many times. So let's see how this goes for this episode moving on to the contents of today. We have a little bit of fleet action footage, uh, just as our last episode. This time, however, with a little more happening, you know. Last time people were a little bit frustrated and I was a little bit frustrated. Nothing happened in the fleet, so this fleet is a bit more action filled. Hopefully you like it. There's a little bit of PvP there. It's a short footage, but I think it was interesting. I learned a lot. I enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed too. Following that, we're gonna do our 1v1s, as I said, they took place here in um, <clears throat> in Do Dixie. Uh, we faced off with today's guest opponent, and let me just bring my UI back. Uh, we're talking about Mr. Markan Murnish. I hope I'm pronouncing this correctly. Thank you very much for for joining the fight for this episode and at the end of the very very end of the episode we did a quick bonus fight with Mr. Super Yo who also kind of happened to be online at that time and wanted to have a 1v1 I think Mr. Super Yo if everything goes fine is gonna be our next guest uh, fighter for the next episode so just this time it's just like my little tiny little bit of fight we have at the very end of, uh, of this of this video so with that, my friends, let me just shut up and let you enjoy. Hope uh, you like it. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you don't like it and why you don't like it. If you're not subscribed, make sure you are subscribed. And I'll see you at the end of the episode. Catch you later. All right, guys, I've been in this fleet for some time. Uh, I thought I'm recording, but apparently I wasn't. Nothing really happened. We're like, what, about... 15 people total, yep. Our fleet commander is Specs. Yeah, and yeah, all set for a move, that's fine. And we are chasing somebody from the opposing yep. faction. I think we just warped this gate. Uh, by the way, the guys cannot hear when I'm talking. And I get disturbed when they talk. So my commander will be a little choppy here. Sorry for this. I don't uh, know, we're we supposed to jump. To fight us. So we're not jumping. Okay, we're not jumping. Yeah, they are not in like Okay. There's okay. only six six blues here. 
Six blues. Only oh. six. That's, That's pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight here. Where is Gary? Is he reshipping possibly? No, but I don't think anybody from that fleet is here. Well, I'm half. So, so what's that mean? We're seven and a half. Us, then, then, uh... Yeah, I think Talon was with them. I'm just gonna check here, I'm pointing. Okay, guys, I was uh, you was uh, Can you guys some fast ships? Uh, the guys, and Levick is good. Uh, scout for me around, just gonna go around, see what's happening. Ooh, Telemachus something uh, we in a crow. Well, I we can I try. Okay. Where is it? Uh, jump, jump, guys. I don't think so. Okay. Too late. Right. Yeah. Too late. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, too late. Uh, rest of us stay on the side. Stay on the leak. Just on the leak. Oh, he jumped back. Sneaky, sneaky. Telamachus or something. Why, back to Josh. Jump back to Josh. Why was not able to, to right. lock Get him? You here, guys, if you can. Okay, jump back. Uh, we got loads of frigates around. Possibly execution errors, execution curses. Jaguar. Okay. We're the bad okay, guys. Thunder jumping through to you guys. Kela, Celat, Sud, whatever he is. Yeah, I can see him. I can see the uh, sneaky. Grab the thunder, he's jumping in front. Just to look at him. So the crow is teasing these guys on this side, he's probably trying to kite them or something. So I'm gonna go on the other side, come on, jump, jump. Must be kidding me, come on. I'm gonna miss the action on the other side of the gate. Okay, got you back in system. If there is any action on the other side, oh here we go. He's in his 270 kilometer safe spot. And am I by myself? Or is a bunch of guys? Is he... No, he's not in any... Huh. Of course they have good safe spots. I mean, they wouldn't be sitting in some crappy... What is his speed? He's pretty speedy, by the way. 4,000 something. Get me... Just burn for him. You know, let's burn for him. Anybody here f on my side? Alright, let's burn for him, man. He's burning way, though. No, no, no. He's, he's, he's cool. He's cool, he's cool. He's going 4,000. Okay, cancel warp, guys, cancel warp, cancel warp. Cancel warp. Oh, he's trying to pull me out. Hmm. Smart bastard. Okay, who's warped? Warp back. But this guy is coming as well. He's pretty fast, too. I, I, I don't know how fast he is, but he's pretty goddamn fast. Okay, he's probably trying to get that guy, too. Don't know. Here is the hey guys. Yeah, regroup on a gate, regroup on a gate. Come to gate to zero. Okay, Which there's Talva, Talvar's cross, right. Talvar's gonna be shooting. If you get aggressed, you're gonna need to. What? Well, in curses. Uh, you need to jump, guys, jump through. If you get aggressed, jump through. If you get aggressed, jump through. How far is this guy? 88. I'm just trying to approach this, this one. But he's. Running away probably with from this person because he's much more scary than I am, uh, and he's probably never going to let us catch him. So I Whoa, guess okay. is going. I'm gonna jump on the other okay, side. Okay, uh, we can't help you because you're gonna die. What's your name? Is T Hazel? Because we, we're not gonna just make you to you. Uh, okay, I'll do my best. What happened? Somebody's dying. Can I read in the chat something? Okay, just hustle. Start. Right, guys. I'm warping. Mm, we're we gonna bounce and we're gonna bounce back. Okay, straight away warp to the warp to our stubber. Who is the stubber man? I should have listened. In warp. Ooh, that Roger. is okay, difficult. Roger, catch the crow. Crow. Uh, I warp the fleet back. Guys, so you can grab them. Mm, can I? God damn it! Can I warp to these guys? 
No, but I can warp to this. Okay, Talwar primary. Talwar primary. Talwar primary. Warp drive active. Target broadcasted. Talwar primary. Get a point. point. Warp drive active. Talwar primary. As soon as I approach the tower. Second point. Good. Okay, I'm pretty fast. So I'm gonna be locking red shoot. Okay, already group on specs, already group on specs, already group on specs, guys. Where Don't is specs? Too much. Can I approach you at least? Where is specs? Already group on specs. I'm sorry, I don't see specs. That crow is just too fast. It's it's annoying when I don't see specs. Oh, here we go, specs. Uh, specs. I don't see specs. Oh, okay, approach. Hmm. Okay. Too late. I really cannot get used to this fleet. Maybe this is one of the most frustrating things: the fleet overview and all these things. I just don't know what's going on. I'm used to my lonely pilot overview. I don't have anything else. It's just me. What's going on now? Who is this? This is Marek Rin. This is Matt Para. Oh, there's the whole gang. Okay, good, good, good. Where are the bad guys? There's one bad guy here in a crucifier. And there's a couple more bad guys around about. What happened now? Oh, okay. I get it. We're back to the gate. Okay, Why is everybody so quiet? Harbinger primary. Ooh, Harbinger. Harbinger primary. Get a point. Get a point. Is he jumped? Is he jumped? Jump. Oh, yes. yes. Jump, 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 jump. Okay, jump, jump, jump. Guys, jump. Jump, 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 jump. All of you, jump. Yes, yes, I'm on the other side. Uh, Harbinger. Harbinger primary. Please, 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 please. No. 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 Oh. Okay, Harbinger, get a, get a point on Harbinger, primary is the Thrasher. Okay, uh, Korox primary, got it, he heads Okay, I got a point okay, on Harbinger. the Harbinger. All DPS on Harbinger, all DPS on Harbinger. Yeah, I didn't get anything on him. Overload your guns, overload your guns. Okay, now back, back, orbit. Make it a little slower, man. I'm way too fast with this. Uh, okay, we're getting into action. You take that harbinger. Let me shoot him, actually. Overload your guns, guys. Yes, Condor. Goodbye, Mr. Harbinger. Pew, pity, pew, pity, pew. <laughs> nice. Nice. Okay, after him gonna be Crow. Crow, if you can catch him. Crow. He's coming uh, close. Approach. Grab Where's him. Grab him, guys. Crow Where's is coming close. Grab him. I'm trying. I'm trying. My small guys. Uh, try to grab him. Okay. Don't, 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 don't. Approach the gate. Approach the gate. All approach the gate. Approach the, gate. the gate. The gate. Where's the gate? Damn it. Where's stop, the gate? Stop chase. Approach the gate, guys. Approach the gate. It's pointless. Oh, come on. The gate. I got so excited, I don't know where the gate is. Oh, okay, here's the gate. The ah, yes! We got the carbinger, uh, man! Go fast. I'm excited. Somebody? As you may tell. So now I don't know, are we orbiting something here? Doing something? Whatever Whatever is happening, man. The condor is Grab pretty... Load, guys. I'm gonna be warping squad soon. Uh, fleet location in Lake Yuri don't come at the moment yet. Let's turn off this. Okay, I'm warping squad guys. Ooh, Hyperion. Hyperion is actually a battleship, isn't it? We cannot hear. Did I warp squad? Yes? No? I have no idea, man. Did, did I manage to warp the squad? Yes, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. There's some. Algos, Greta, uh, he warped. Warp drive. If somebody tackle warp point and gate, warp point and gate, warp point and gate, or jump through. There is a battleship. We cannot really take a battleship, unfortunately. Mm, that's pity. 
I was hoping we will go for it though. Whoa, why is so okay? Gonna walk back to just a metal. Have a look what's happening there. Why it's only like about five people or four people with me? This I don't know, my friend. Peter Presley is saying in local, LOL, Gary Hyperion. Only one squad. Did I, I come in squad? peace. Okay, guys, I'm with you. Shit. Okay, cool, cool. Ooh, Zach is online. Hello, Zach. I don't know if we will be able okay, to talk right now. How many destroyers? Blah 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 blah. Corax, yes. Merlin. We got thrashing coming too for me. Okay. So we cannot really attack Hyperion this guy. Uh, Do not aggress, guys, on this side. Ooh. No, it's the Hyperion who's aggressing. Is that crow aggressive? If you get shot, guys, need to jump. Let's jump, let's jump, let's jump. Okay, everyone jump, just a metal. Jump, everyone jump, just a metal. Like jump, 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 Oh, that okay, was close. Can somebody grab, grab a battle cruiser? Can somebody um, grab a battle cruiser? Nope, but I'm gonna grab my uh, repair. Got a battle cruiser and you like Yuri? Oh, yes, maybe. Uh, reship, guys, fast. Reship fast. We're gonna be engaging, uh, Gary. Uh, grab the battle, battle cruisers. Uh, and reship fast and adjust a metal warp to like Yuri gate. Okay. We're gonna be engaging, guys. You need to come yourselves. We're gonna be engaging. Okay, rest of the frigate, who is me? Approach the Lake Yuri Gate. Approach the Lake Yuri Gate. We're gonna be jumping in. I'm in my destroyer. We're gonna be holding Gary as much as possible down. Uh, let him... Everyone jump, jump. Jump Lake Yuri. Uh, rest of the battle cruisers, you're gonna join us. Wait for a command. Go up to Lake Yuri Gate. Well, if he is a new fit, he is a new fit. Okay, everyone approach the gate. <laughs> Yeah, I needed to repair. Is the Gary aggressed? Is the Gary aggressed? Uh, uh, I don't think I have a battle cruiser. In fact, I don't even think I have a cruiser. Uh, so tell me if, so if he aggresses on somebody. I jumped. I'm reapproaching the gate. Okay, just a second. Reapproach the gate. Do not do not aggress, guys. Really curie. Uh, Let me just gate. warp to five fifty-two. Okay. Okay. Have a look. What's happening? Yeah, reapproach the gate, guys. Reapproach the gate. Don't jump. Stay in the gate. Hyperium. Chickens out. Get a thrasher. Uh, point on thrasher. Point and Trasher. There's one of those moments where everybody's talking, uh, I don't know what's going on. Okay, I'm repaired. I'm back in action. Almost died here. Close call. Hmm. Oh, I like this. This is a good fleet. Okay, everyone reapproach the gate. Uh, battle cruisers, wait on the other side. Don't jump in yet. Don't jump, please. That was not a good idea. Battle cruisers, if you are on a battle cruiser, wait in a, on a just a metal gate on Lake Curie. Be waiting, maybe Gary will come. Oh, that was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Okay. I have to warp away. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh no, they killed me. Oh no. Of course they killed me. He's in a destroyer. That was a mistake. That was a mistake yeah, of me. Couple. Can I say something? Thank you. I'm going to reship, guys, and I'm going to come back. <clears throat> and welcome back, guys. As you may notice, I'm in a different ship. <laughs> also in a different system. And believe it or not, it's a different day. Actually, it's the next day. I had to log off after that um, emergency warp out last, uh, last night. So I never got to see the end of the um, fleet action. Nevertheless, uh, we have here Markon Mernish, a person who responded to our challenge last um, episode for 1v1s. And now we are ready to go and pit ourselves into a best of three 1v1 tournament, if you will. So we're going to fight three times and whoever wins most out of those three times uh, wins the day. So we are fully tram marked with uh, no repair systems, uh, tech to tank entirely. Well, not the not the plating, and we have a 400 millimeter reinforced roll tungsten for the win. Uh, unfortunately, we are uh, sporting 
metaphor guns because I am still not um, no, I, I admit guys I'm a little sloppy with my training so I haven't trained my pulse energy beams so I'm having a dual modulated pulse energy beam I got them for a hundred fifty bucks thousand bucks so it's pretty good I guess a good deal and have Imperial Navy multi-frequency probably somebody is going somebody's going to uh, criticize me for this but hey I'm learning it seemed like the best choice and my opponent I'm kind of suspicious uh, it's gonna be against me in a in curses let's see we're gonna be invited to a duel right now I'm gonna orbit at 500 as well are we orbiting now yes uh, and accept let's just quickly web the guy and laid the hurt okay I'm guessing he's going to be a active armor repair fit which is a bit of a problem because right now I'm hitting his armor and he's gonna start repairing it. I'm just buffer so I have no way of doing anything to him. I'm just trying to orbit him as close as possible, trying to minimize any sort of any sort of um, transversal here make sure damage is minimized he's repairing still I'm sure he's boosting his capacitor so there is high probability he's gonna last for quite some time let's see uh, yes he's repairing as you can see up here I'm at the end of my armor so Don't know why it takes me so long to turn, probably because I'm super slow. What I'm hoping is that it's gonna run out of out of uh, charges, but he seems he's doing pretty well with the charges. Yep, doing pretty well with his charges. Still repairing pretty successfully everything I can throw at him, which is pretty goddamn sad. And probably he has drones. It's quite possible. I don't see them, but uh, they're probably there. Okay, that was not a good idea. And I'm losing my armor, bleeding structure, and most probably going to lose that one. Oh god this is not good and we are done good job mr. Markan Mernish first first round is his oh man that was way too loud let me see if I can somehow maybe bring down a little bit the master sound because I was wow good fight Okay, guys, we're back in the action, or the action is about to start soon. We have our um, opponent today once more in a different ship, Tristan this time. Another gal fine Galante ship. I'm still in my Punisher this time. I fit it slightly differently. I have the same weapons and the same ammunition, but this time instead of Trimarks, I'm using um, repair setup. So I have two nanobot accelerators and auxiliary pump. I have, um, let me just discuss first this and then we continue with the dual. I have uh, a take to repair, a 200 millimeter reinforced tungsten, and the same resistance is pretty much almost the same as before. And mids are the same. And with that, my friends, let's see how we can um, 
approach this fight. Accept. Okay. And ready to go, my friends. I'm a little worried. We're not going to... Okay, we, we gotta be careful. Oh, he's... Um, he's supping, sucking my energy with a newt. Which is bad news for me. I just lost all my energy. And I'm basically at the mercy of his newt. The only thing I can think of doing is perhaps... Trying to get range. Trying to get range a little bit, get out of his newt range. Get a rep. Get a rep, get a rep. Yes, thank you. Get a rep. Get a rep, get a rep. And that was it. <laughs> it was too fast. Too bad, Tristan is a evil, evil machine, and I didn't even last as much as I lasted last time. Pretty goddamn bad. Pretty goddamn bad. Dang! Good fight. <coughs> Lol. Uh, well, the the newt did the trick. So that newt really ki killed me. It kind of drained my power. I was active repping and on a, a Mars ship that generally relies for everything on electricity. A newt is uh, bad news. So I guess this is where we are standing. So two out of three are in his favor. So I think that we're going to have the last one just for fun because it's obvious that my friend has defeated me uh, more than more than enough let's see if I can bookmark can I bookmark is that my where's my thing let's bookmark my thing see if I can grab my loot later on yeah okay good um, so I'm gonna reship my friends and we'll be back here for yet another duel see you later Guys, we're ready for round three. Uh, we have already lost, actually, uh, but it's for fun. So the third one is really just a bonus round. Let me just quickly use my typical name, the lower. I'm not going to even insure that one. I don't think we're going to get our money's worth. It's just a uh, lost couple of seconds spending time on this. I'm going to warp to my wreck to about 20 kilometers and this time around my friends I have gone long range this is a pulse no sorry a beam laser the tech 2 variety because I have one and uh, we have dual web the only reason that we have dual web is because I couldn't fit anything else and I felt bad about fighting with one empty mid slot so I thought well since we're going for range and speed you know down here our only tank is this really the damage uh, control so here is my opponent uh, so shall we go how how do I, I constantly forget how to invite to a duel okay he's still okay he's an incursus Now, so last one was Tristan, now he's an incursus. Uh, let's go away from him. Okay.
And my strategy here is really to keep uh, distance away from him. Now this is going to be a difficult one because he is quite fast as well. So I need to make sure he doesn't hit me in any way, but I have to also come close to him to hit him. Uh, okay, so we lost connection. <laughs> okay, that's gonna be a funny one. I have zero and he's disrupting my tracking, which is really bad. Uh, why can't I... S oh. Okay, something happened, I lost lock. Remember? Oh yes, of course I lost lock because we were way too far away from him. Come on, shoot! This is way too poor a fight. I'm doing a crappy job fighting him. Probably I should get a better orbit. And accept the fact that I need to come closer to his long range ship thingies. That's Let's keep high transversal. He's probably going to try to... Okay, now we have established some sort of orbit here. Let's make sure we... We maintain th that orbit. Okay, he managed to escape my grasp. Which I don't know what it is due to. If it is the overheating of the propulsion module or... Can't really figure out if he's flying. I think he's an, an arm, um, afterburner. Okay, he's constantly... Whenever I'm close to, to, to him, he's constantly going for the... Oh no. That's the end, really. I don't think we're gonna ever do anything meaningful to him. Okay, another time we land with our evil... But every time I land with the evil stuff on him, he kinda manages to escape, so I don't know. I'm in structure now, so it's kind of... And you see, he's gaining a lot of speed quickly. I don't know how, how he manages to do this. Okay, got him again. He's doing something special, I don't know what. Okay, now we're really close to each other. Probably not a very good idea for me. See, he's... He's speeding a lot. He has... He must have... Some sort of... Crazy stuff going on, because he's going faster than me, I don't know. Oh wow, he's so close. He's so close. Come on, don't tell me I, I will lose. Wow, yes, baby. Come on. <laughs> I didn't believe this is going to happen, actually. Come on, this is funny. Wow. 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 Man, that was good. Good fight. I didn't really, I didn't expect that to happen. Good fight, man. Did not expect to win. Really, no. That was a big surprise to me. Uh, wow, Executioner, man. I didn't know Executioners can do this. It's pretty awesome. Dual Web Executioner. Let me ask, was there was that a MWD? Ah, that is why. That is why that that is why he was able to escape my uh, my stuff every time. So let me go back to my wreck. Just pick up my stuff. Hmm. That is, is why you were, were able to kite my 
to webs. Well, I guess there was a little bit of luck there. Uh, I guess something happened and maybe he just ran out of juice or something. Let me ask, did you eventually truly run of juice? Or or that was not an active not an active rep I don't know that was weird at one point I, I didn't you know expect to see him so low in armor and structure and everything <laughs> okay he doesn't remember if he was an active rep that's okay that's okay that is not a problem let me grab my stuff as much as I can uh, this is worth something at least and that last ship this one uh, is actually not the cheapest one actually it's probably out of all of them was the most expensive because of the because of the beam laser right okay my friends I'm excited my hands are shaking I'm, I'm no I'm very excited I'm very excited so I'm um, let me just dock in repair my ship get my stuff straight and perhaps if time permits we may actually do a little bit of fight with Mr. Super Yo who is most probably so also somewhere around and perhaps willing to do a 1v1 here we go he is actually here he's in the system okay see you in a little bit And we can start the duel. The duel is on. We have Super Yo on the other side. Federation Navy Command. This is, well, this is a faction frigate which are known to eat Tech One frigates for breakfast. So I don't expect this to last very long. In fact, I don't expect this to last at all. But hey, well, we don't know. So let's see. He's um. He's killing me already. Hmm. Uh, he's probably long ranged enough to do bad, bad damage to me. Let's try to be a little more far away from him, even at the cost of not webbing him. Okay, so I'm not webbing him anymore. Not doing much damage either, so it's kind of neither nor. No, why did I stop my web? This is a little bit of a disaster, I think. I'm out of armor and everything else, but I'm doing damage, which is pretty amazing. I don't know if the comments are armor, frigates, or what. Okay, we're far away from each other. I don't really know what the comments are doing as as frigates so I'll have to oh no that was it that was it my friends the last fight of tonight super yo Federation Navy coming versus mine curses I'm um, sorry my executioner is he gonna pot me now dude he's gonna pot me uh, well good for man GF GF it was a good fight though. No. No, he didn't pot me. Okay. That's cool. He's a cool guy. And here we are at the end of this video. It was interesting. I enjoyed making it and, and enjoy playing for you guys. I actually also play for me, of course. But uh, making Let's Plays is uh, for YouTube. So. In case you have some suggestions, you have some pointers, advice, you just want to contact me, you want to be on the on the next um, 1v1 guest fight list, write me a message. I have discovered that it is a little bit easier to receive messages uh, in game, so prefer if you send me an actual Eve mail. Not that I'm not going to react to anything else, but the email kind of keeps it all together nice and bundled in one place. Hopefully next episode we're going we're gonna to bring you a little better fleet action. Or maybe even 
my own fleet action, meaning I'm going to be already finally leading a fleet. Don't know, do not want to promise this, but let's see. Nobody knows. If nothing changes, and if the plan is, um, <clears throat> let's say, um, the plan is uh, successful, we're going to have our next guest uh, person uh, for the next episode for the 1v1. It's going to be Super, Super Yo. I'm looking forward. This is a veteran player with uh, quite a lot of skill points. It's going to be a tough fight. The bonus fight from today was just a little bit of a... Uh, of a demonstration and obviously uh, he was in a tougher ship but nevertheless it was all about fun congratulations to our official contestant today and let me just bring back his name i'm sorry i just really want to make sure i'm reading the right name here so markan mernish congratulations you actually in fact won the best of three uh, even though I had the last one, that was an exciting one. I really didn't at all expect it to happen, but all the more fun and enjoyment and excitement on my part. I'm sure um, Khan didn't really like it, but hey, you won. So there you go. Until next time, guys, I'm going to sign off now. Sir Click is going to be going back to the real life, perhaps doing more Let's Plays in other games. Otherwise, stay in touch, leave a like, Subscribe if you're not subscribed and fly safe if you, you know, if you don't care for flying crazy. I'll see you on the other side. Bye bye.